good morning. Welcome to filmmyrun.com. My name's Stephen Cousins. I've never been to Guernsey before. Today, we're going to run 36 miles around the perimeter of the island. It should be absolutely amazing. The weather is stunning and hopefully it'll stay like this all day. Last year, there were about 20 runners, so I'm told. This year, 70. Let's see if next year we can make it 170. So the rule is, keep the C on your left. If it's not on your left, you've gone the wrong way. This is the town of St Peter's Port, main town in Guernsey, very pretty. Okay, one and a half K in, a mile in, and we're just doing our first climb up a set of steps by the aquarium. There's the castle in the distance. Okay, so we're an hour in to the GU36. We're running over the cliffs. First 16 miles of this race is all cliffs, but do you know what? It's absolutely beautiful. Look at this beach down here, look. I do a lot of coastal marathons, coastal ultras, and you know, already this is right up there with them for, for beautiful scenery. hours in to the GU36. We've climbed 570 metres. They like their steps in Guernsey, let me tell you that. We've got the lighthouse over there and we've got a huge gun turret up there so that means we're reaching the end of the cliff section now it's about 1000 meters of climbing over these cliffs and then the next 20 miles is really quite flat everything that you'd expect from a good ultra lots of fruit lots of sweets lots of nuts cake a little bit of watermelon left It's gone four hours in and we're halfway. Do you know what? I'm not entirely sure I'm supposed to be running on the beach, but there was an orange marker leading down here, so here I am. And I'm very, very tempted to go and splash some cold seawater on my head. What do you think? It's cold seawater. Coming into the third checkpoint at 40 kilometers, just in time, because I'm running out of water. This is what it's all about. When you're running an ultra, it's not about time, it's about enjoying yourself. Oh, there we are, I just ticked over to 48 kilometers, so that means 10k to go. 6 hours 18, hopefully we'll get in around 7.5 hours. Very pretty by the sea, glad of that swim though. Really cooled my muscles down. So 
we're just rounding the harbour now at St Peter's Port. You can see the castle over there in the distance and the Liberation Monument is somewhere in the middle there. So it's literally, it's got to be only a couple of kilometres. It's seven hours and five minutes now, so we will get in under 7.30, but um, it's by no means a fast run today. Less than a mile to go. Really hurting now. Just want to stop. It's absolutely beautiful run. Beaches, beautiful cliffs, beautiful views. Jersey there in the distance. It's all been gorgeous. beautiful isn't it? Yeah. So this is Peter who organised the event this year for the first time. First 16 miles, 1000 metres elevation over the hills, stunning views, absolutely beautiful. If you're not into that then you get 20 miles of flat beautiful sandy beaches, coves, coffee shops if you want to, ice cream parlours, plenty of toilets, absolutely gorgeous. End of May, should be nice and sunny, if not, doesn't matter, it's gorgeous anyway. Thank you, Peter. If you've never been to the Channel Islands, why not make it a long weekend? Come to Channel Islands, come to Guernsey and do this ultra. If you live in the Channel Islands, you've no excuse not to do this next year. That's it from Guernsey. I've got to get changed and get a ferry back to the mainland so we've got to be quick thanks very much for watching my name's Stephen Cousins this is filmmyrun.com we've been to Guernsey in August we're going to Jersey 48 miles around Jersey so join me for that we're from Guernsey 36 miles been absolutely gorgeous in the sunshine see you again next time bye bye